Oh, so it's just another one of those dinosaurs are alive videos. Okay. In today's video, we'll be looking at a T-Rex caught on camera, raptors going here and there, and little Brachiosauruses crossing the road. I think I saw two of these clips before, one being the raptor and the other one being these mini Brachiosaurs. But let's start our video with this very real and very smart pterosaur caught on camera. Uh, was I at it? Even though an amateur video, and with the source unknown, this one seems to be the perfect one to include in our list, and on the very top of it. You put it on the start of the list and said it was the top. Who knows what abomination would be next? We know pterosaurs from the movies and fossils, and if you ask me, these were the coolest things to ever fly on Earth. Also, notice the title, we're showing pterosaurs, which are not dinosaurs. Too bad we don't get to see them nowadays. I mean, mostly. But these guys did, and fortunately recorded them for us too. I'm really glad, you know? The next one that I have for you was caught on a CCTV camera in Florida. What do you think? Notice how this thing suddenly appeared? That's quite fishy. What came to my mind after watching it for the first time was a raptor! I was like- Even if it's supposed to be a quote-unquote non-avian dinosaur still being alive, this definitely does not look like a raptor. It might just be some sort of iguana, or a peacock, or even a fox, but not a raptor. Like, oh god, is this even real? Well, it looks quite real to me, and you decide for yourself. No way you believe that's real, dude. They be calling it a baby dinosaur, but we know that our raptors are usually this size, right? And here we have another one. We need to look at this one very closely and carefully. Did you see it? Let's have a closer look. Probably just an edited thing, or if it's not, it's probably just another bird. With its three horns, a parrot-like beak, and a large frill, no matter how scary the Triceratops look, they are my favorite! Obviously, this is supposed to be some sort of act, and a regular Triceratops would probably be just as aggressive as the Rhino. Now, this one looks fake to you too. Some say it's a robot that they have, while some say it's a real one just being controlled by humans. That claim would be... One bajillion percent ridiculous. If you ask me, I'm just loving the way he's walking. If it was real, he would have been doing the same, I guess. Can't be sure, you know, as long as the scientists say otherwise. I feel like this is supposed to appeal to the mainstream with all of these, you know, crazy fans over here. Champ, spotted in Lake Champlain, is a lake monster thought to be a dinosaur that avoided extinction. What the f*** is that claim? This is probably the most ridiculous claim I've ever heard of. It does not even look like a dinosaur at all. What does it look like? It looks more like a, some sort of plant or another animal in the swamp, but like not a non-avian dinosaur. There, there's a dinosaur on that thing. That's a bird. There have been over 300 reports of an unknown beast roaming the area. When some people were out fishing in the lake in 2005, they recorded this footage. The video begins with a long snake-like creature swimming near the water's surface, and subsequently shows the monster's tail through the end of the video. Two former FBI image analysts examined the tape and agreed that it was legitimate and not modified in any manner. Do they say it's a dinosaur though? Or do they think it's just a wild conspiracy theory? You never know, this may be a dinosaur. Maybe a Titanoboa. I mean, it can be, right? No, the Titanoboa went extinct. Our next clip went viral on the internet two years back when a man caught a Brachiosaurus on camera. I can confidently say that this is edited. The guy was with his family just enjoying the evening when he spotted something unusual around him. He took his camera out and started recording, and that is when he saw a huge Brachiosaurus having a walk. If this doesn't scream edited, then I don't know 
what will because this seems incredibly fake. It was quite far, so the footage is not that clear. But, well, it's a dinosaur. Even then, it looks quite goofy even for a dinosaur. Was it shrink-wrapped? We all know the fact that dinosaurs were a diverse group of reptiles. First, take a look at this one. That is not a dinosaur. That... That thing looks more like some sort of Metrorhynchus, but not a dinosaur. It doesn't really look like Metrorhynchus, but whatever. It's not a dinosaur. Many people felt it was a fake when a gigantic alligator was recorded on camera strolling on a Florida golf course. You even admitted that it's an alligator? That is not a dinosaur at the slightest. With all four legs extended. The video went viral almost instantly, but many have been saying that this looked more like a Dinosuchus than a croc. The creature's so-called high walk, which was recorded on video, was one of the main reasons for its terrifying appearance. That is a bit weird. When gators are on the move, they are often considerably closer to the ground. The Dinosuchus walked like this one did. Also, just to let you know, alligators and crocodiles are not the same. So, what do you say? Is that a Dinosuchus or a Croc? It was spotted by other people too at different times. Have a look. That is a different animal. Definitely not the same as the one showed in the previous clip. This one is the most real footage you will ever come across when searching about the chances of dinosaurs being real still. When going somewhere on a highway, the man spotted some weird creatures crossing the road, and he was shocked to see what these animals were. It's definitely something running backwards. The tail upright may look like a Brachiosaurus, but it isn't. We can see two cars, one with the man recording it all, and the other one opposite to it. Both of them have stopped to let the little dinosaurs pass by and must be just as surprised as you and I are when witnessing this whole scene. Okay, so I checked the comments and these are just reverse squirrels. Squirrels just basically on reverse. Just passing by a place on a very normal day, these three people accidentally recorded something no one was supposed to see. A huge T-Rex can be seen in the background. That is definitely not real. That is probably some sort of animatronic. No, not animatronic, but like, um, how do I describe it? Some sort of replica? Uh, see, it's how they're real, whatever, believe me. But the way they reacted to it, and the guy recording it all, did not even take time to look at what was happening, make it all seem fake to me. He should have at least looked that way or reacted to it, but he didn't. It appeared like it was a normal routine for them to have a Tyrannosaurus eat grass in their backyard. Well, a T-Rex can also eat plants like any other carnivore to supplement some of its needs. Moving back to raptors. Oh, you're talking about raptors, but you're just showing Gallimimus instead. They usually prefer to dwell in caves. And this is supposed to be an other raptorid, all right? As we know already, and this clip might be an indication to them still being alive. This clip was recorded by a local explorer, and it appears to show- This is probably just some sort of bird and not a raptor. Know that dinosaurs are still alive and well, but they're hiding. Many skeptics viewed his footage as an obvious hoax, mostly because dinosaurs are generally considered to be extinct. Non-avian dinosaurs, to be more specific, avian dinosaurs, aka birds, are still around today. But also because of the unlikely new habitat for the species. The wanderer has never changed his story, insisting that he saw a real-life dinosaur near the cave. But while his story continues to be ripped apart by people, he sticks to what he said. Gotta give this man at least a bit of credit for this video, but like, that's not it, bro. Isn't it weird how dinosaurs that are spotted are mostly raptors and T-Rexes, like in the next entry? This video is only 13 seconds long and is of poor quality with no color. Maybe it was recorded at night. Well, the source remains unknown. 
I don't trust that being a non-avian dinosaur. Non-avian dinosaurs were already extinct. As I said, like, 200 gazillion times before. But what is important is how this video shows strange creatures sitting in the bushes at the edge of the woods. Quite large, and you can see them moving too. Just a few seconds longer, and we witness it raise its head, and you'll recognize it right away. Yes, that's right, it's the famous Tyrannosaurus Rex. The T-Rex is literally mentioned in every single video at this point. At least in my channel. Hmm. Maybe that one was a real one. Who knows? Okay, so another raptor? That looks much more like an ostrich. If it isn't an ostrich, maybe like... A uh, more plausible guess would be a Gallimimus by the video. But the Gallimimus is extinct like every other non-avian dinosaur. So, no. Well, there are rumors that scientists have been trying to clone these beastly creatures, and now after watching so many videos, I've started to think that maybe they've succeeded, to some extent, I guess. The man who recorded this claims that he risked his life to get such footage. What I watched this clip before. I remember it's one of the thumbnails of my video. Which is just really dumb. Also, it was stripped from the OG Jurassic Park scene from the flocking Gallimimus. But you think about it. Is he lying? Well, in the end, it's all up to you to decide. Have a closer look again, and then do not forget to let us know your thoughts in the comments. Discussing dinosaurs, let's take a look at this one too. Five dinosaur eggs have been discovered in China's Guangdong province. Fossilized ones. If these are dinosaur eggs, the, they're supposed to be fossilized, and there's no life inside. The eggs are 70 million years old, according to experts. Three of the five eggs were destroyed, yet the fossil still showed them. They were most likely the remains of a Cretaceous plant-eating dinosaur. What sort of plant-eating dinosaur is my question? So, what do you say? Will the scientists be able to get the life out of them, or are they of no use? No. It's 70 million years. There was no way that the, the infants and the fossils have survived. If you ask me, I'd say it'd be really fun to get the dinosaurs back to life properly. I mean, if it's possible, that is. Although not a dinosaur, this one entry demands to be in the video. I mean, we've all watched the Ice Age, right? Love Manny? I do too. What would you think if I said that maybe the Manny is real? It's probably just going to be a bonus segment of the video with the mammoth shenanigans. Just waiting to be found out by humans. Surprised? Said to be extinct for 4,000 years, there is no chance of them still being alive. Apart from this one clip. This clip was initially released in 2012. Actually, by the looks of it, it's probably just another elephant, some sort of elephant. And it says that the gigantic woolly mammoth still roams the freezing wastelands of Siberia. But if this quote-unquote mammoth is from Siberia, it should have a lot of snow. The enormous creature, which has the appearance of a hairy elephant, is seen traversing a frozen river. And now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. This is definitely not a living animal. Definitely not. Because it's a T-Rex and T-Rexes are extinct. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you've come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is taken from a clip where a T-Rex was spotted on a truck. He was tied to it, so he couldn't move around. Even if there's blood, it's probably just red paint. And, uh, because the T-Rex here is fake. Or go do something dangerous. Just as we know these T-Rexes are, right? I know the first thought of yours after watching this one would be, it's a fake. Am I not right? But, well, I thought so too. Thought it was just for some promotional purpose like the autopsy one was. Let me show you. But let me assure you, these two aren't the same. It's still not a real T-Rex. It's probably some sort of thing controlled. And the truck one seems more real to me. Tell me what you think about it in the comments below. Bruh. 
there's really nothing to say about this video. This is it for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of our upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again. There's really nothing this video wants to offer. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. <laughs>